Hey, what's happening, gamers? Welcome back to Octopath Traveler. It's time Yay! for Sir Ulbrick. 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 Uh, this guy. Old Bear. Old Bear? Ulbrick. <gasps> the brigands are holed up in yonder cave. Oh, no. It's surely most dangerous. D -d -d Danger, watch me. Oh. Sorry, Best sorry. prepare, sir. So anyway, uh, welcome back to Octopath. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because we're doing more of this game. Indeedest. I love this demo so far. It's a lot of fun. So we can get some healing grapes, a sword. Okay. No, it's awesome. A silver dagger, a circlet. A, a wet noodle. No, I don't see that listed. <laughs> wow. A rubber chicken. That actually increases our attack uh, substantially. 139. From 109. Yes. I say we do it. Okay. I say we just like swallow the cost. <gasps> and now we can't get Mama. any defense. Except for, well, we could get an iron helmet, but healing grapes are important because they heal you. And well, they're grapes. I mean, yeah, they're great. And they're grapes. But are they cherry flavored? No, because they're, they're grapes. They would be grape. Blizzard. I thought it would just be called, like, healing grape, and then it would taste like bananas. No. Because... That's what I would do. If I was a wizard in these fantasy games, like, you would buy something and think it was that, but in reality it wasn't. But... So you would buy healing grapes from me, and it would taste like anchovies. Oh. But you would have to eat them to survive, and then when you came <laughs> back, I'd be like, oh, I'm sorry. No, this is not Why? the one. Why? Why ruin perfectly good grapes and make them taste like salty and it weird? It is called Trolling Travelers. Oh my gosh. And I would really enjoy it, you know? But you wouldn't enjoy eating it. You just Well, I know that the gross stuff, <laughs> sounding stuff, would actually be the most delicious. Challenge you! Oh, so the anchovies would taste like Twizzlers. Yes. Actually, <laughs> if Twizzlers was a thing. So there's a chest here. Let's open this up. It would taste like Jello Pops. Healing Jello Pops, yes. Delish. Except for the Jello Pops would taste oh. like spinach. Our battle against rats? Rats. Oh, rats. We ran into some rats. Rats. Rodents are OTSs. So they do exist. All right, so we're going to use our wait, a flurry attack. Oh, wait, that they sounds do fun. exist. You know what? Level slash, attack two enemies at once. Don't get yourself in a flurry. Booyah! Oh. That was fun. That was cool. They're weak. Ow. They have weak written Ow. on them. That's not very nice. The game is already saying they're oh, Wait, weak. they have weak written on them? Look at, underneath each rat, it says weak. Yeah, that would actually make me feel kind of bad. So I like this ability that I can attack uh, multiple enemies at once. So let's see what it does leveled up. It does that. Wow. So long, rats. The thrill of smiting rats. No items. Those so were basically, cheap rats. Ulbrich used to be a knight. Now he's a pest control guy. Well, I mean, at least he's getting, you know, grapes. Did he get paid for that? Because I didn't see No, he's, he's not a sellsword. He's uh, a uh, uh, he fights village for, protector. For righteousness. No. And justice. No. He fights for, you know, a... Let us fight with ah, fights more for rats. his village. Is it his village or is he just kind of, you know, freeloading? Ow. It's time to do 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 they did it, did, did, do not like that. Ow. Yeah, they... Oh, come on. That's just not nice. You rats are vermin. See what I did there? Yeah, that wasn't very nice of you to call them vermin. So there's multiple ways that I can attack in this, which, uh, I mean, I found my method, which works for me. If uh, Ulbrich mean... attacks people, yeah. every once in a while you get the ability to stun them, which is always fun. Yeah, and then if you... It looks like if you defend a couple times, then you're well, super move meter builds up or something like that. Mm -hmm. Special move. His Ulbrichness. It's called his boost meter. Yeah, I mean, like, my my strategy would just be stand there and look awesome and have everyone run away from me. You want to know another reason why we like this game? Because the music is amazing. Besides that, Cause... it's by the same team that gave us uh, one of my favorite RPGs of the last couple of years. Mm -hmm. The uh, Brave series. 
Oh, bravely default. Bravely default. Yep. Cool. Bravely I, second and bravely. We ever, default. Did we ever beat that, or uh, we were we were playing it for quite a while? We played it for quite a while, and then the live streams didn't post, so we're ahead in the game, and the live streams are gone. Oh. Yeah. So when people saw those live. YouTube didn't post them. Why? So that means when we start again, we're at least like three episodes ahead of what they last saw. Well, we could just be like, sometime later. Sometime later, after things you never saw. <laughs> Aha! Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah. I would watch it, but yeah, you're right. You'd never live it down because people would be yelling at It's not finished! <sighs> I know. I love it how when you when you know when you lose save data or something like that, people are always like, "Well, can you go back and start it again and then redo the whole thing and then do it where you left off?" It's like because it would take me like sixty hours to do that. Yeah. It's like because I don't have two days off to do that because I'm not a millionaire and I don't have money just growing out of my ears, so I could just take days off to do that. <laughs> well, I mean, games always continue to release, so I mean, you know. Yeah. But I, I really want to add this to... This is the RPG that I want to do in 2018. Like, I love this. I always wonder, like, people that do, like, Let's Plays, like, tons of them, like, their computer... They're telling me their computer never, like, corrupts a file or anything. Like, what happens if they're missing an episode? What do they do? It's just... They start over. Oh my gosh! Yep, pack That's starts insane. over. That's insane! What's wrong with those people? With the last LEGO Dimension, so he had to start over like four or five times. Oh my gosh, they're hardcore. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't think. Well, we do a lot of different games. Yeah, we do a lot. I of guess different we're games. just, we're just lazy. We're not lazy, but it's like I don't have time to. Once we get a better microphone set up, I'm just gonna record everything through XSplit. This microphone, it works well after we put it through our audio settings yeah. and like turn it into. I've been thinking about that. I need a new. I was thinking we should get two new microphones, one for me and one for you or something. Well, Matt. Well, Matt we'll get I, one for I you suppose. First. Suppose we could. One for you first. But as Indeed. we could each give each other one microphone for Christmas, that would be our Christmas present. Like, thank you, Merry Christmas. There are the bandits. Oh, nope, the rats. Weak rats, it's time for you to be uh, removed from weakness. I don't know. Removed from rat office. I really like the attack where I can hit multiple people. It's my favorite. Yes, the whole feel of this game is so cool. Just sound effects, just the feeling of intensity and awesome voice acting, cool story, and just it well, just makes you feel, like, thrilled like, all the time. I really wish that they spoke all the time, though. That's what I loved about the Bravely series. Again, this is just a demo, but... Oh, yeah. Um, the Bravely series, they talked all the time. And in the demo, uh, for the Bravely games, they didn't always talk. Yeah. So, you know when the full game released, then you saw, oh, there's actually more stuff that they're saying, so I'm hoping that the entire game is voice acted. Yeah. Because I love it. You when love it? I love the acting, yeah. I love it. Hello, brigands! You made it. I did. Kind of. Oh, oh look who we've got here! It's a hedge knight, or something. Move aside before I cut you in two. Because that's what I will do. Ye oh. have courage, I'll give you that. Uh, never seen no edge knight swing a blade the way ye do. Indeed. Then you'll step aside if you know what's good for you. The hell? You're on our land now, hedge knight. We give the orders around here. <laughs> ye have skill. Now we laugh at you. Ah. Oh. Get him! Tried to like sound like multiple people at once, but it didn't. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh. <laughs> Jinx! <laughs> get him! Because there would be uh, dudes that sound like women, you know. <laughs> not not everybody gets a deep voice in life. It's true. Sorry, Dad. Some people are blessed with other things, like having a voice that sounds a lot like Kevin Costner, strangely enough, between <laughs> Kevin Costner and a woman. <laughs> so we're gonna build up our attack meter. <laughs> Savage, Amber. Savage. Uh, See, I said it really quiet, so it's like, oh, I didn't say that. <laughs> what? Uh, <laughs> and boost! Savage! My blade is unbending! 
Level slash. Yes, you're like you've got like power, like chief power, or something like Ryu. Pretty cool. Wow, that didn't take them out. That's impressive. Know, right? uh, well then, fools, let's see how you like this. You ever wonder if the characters in the game can hear the awesome music behind them or no? No, probably not. Oh, to them, it's just a regular day. But... He grows stronger than before. Ever. I wonder if they could put a soundtrack. I wonder if there's someone weird watching our lives and if they have a soundtrack while they're watching us. Hmm, be strong. <laughs> I'm coming for you. I don't know. It's probably possible. not. So the bandits are inside this yonder cave. Don't go in, Sir Ulbrick. You're the only one. You can't oh, survive wow. on your own. So I actually had a question for you. What was it like uh, playing as the girl? Did you go to the same locations as the guy? Uh, Did you go no. inside a cave? We didn't. Yeah, there was an underground, like, kind of like, uh, I don't know if it was a sewer system, but it was like, uh, like, kind of like, I don't know why I felt like I was in London or something, the streets of, like, it was like just brick areas with a lot of steps. And it, I think it was kind of an underground passageway or something, but it wasn't a, it wasn't a natural cave or anything. Okay, so, so it was a totally different place. So they go to different areas then at the start. That's cool. Yeah, it was a totally different town and everything. Like, well, was, you know, like you're in a village. The girl starts out in a big town that has, I would say, somewhat like a city or, but it's not giant city, but you know. So what kind of enemies did you end up fighting? Like giant rats and. Mm, there weren't rats. There were these weird like, uh, like purple orb things, and then there was like some birds. <laughs> birds. And then there was obviously a, a bad dude that I wasn't strong enough to fight because I actually kept fleeing from all the little animals down in the sewer system, so probably should have fought them so I could have been grinding to actually get stronger. Mm -hmm. The only thing I didn't understand is, like, I only had 300 gold starting out, and I had to get, a like, a one weapon. I only could afford, like, a tiny, like, mm, what was it, like, <laughs> dagger or something? Okay. And I didn't have, like, a... I don't know how much I needed, like a thousand or six hundred or something for a bigger sword. It's about two hundred. So I don't, I don't know. Each each upgrade, like at the beginning, it's not super expensive. Uh, usually about yeah. two hundred for armor, three or four hundred for a sword. What do we got? Healing grapes. Awesome. Love me some healing grapes. Ah, I gotta fight again. More rats. I have to say, though, the story for the girl really did make you feel for the character and all the other girls that she knew and stuff, so... You know, like, there was a lot of the feels in these, uh, in this game, definitely. Mm-hmm. Well, anything Ow. that, you know, Square does. Okay, so... It's hard to not feel something with this awesome music. Oh, it's amazing. I mean, I really wish the game was out right now. I, I mean, this is this is this something is that ah. I hope I think it's coming out around my birthday. I think it's a February game. Just like the only problem is it's coming out at the same time as Dragon Ball Fighters, which oh. is like going to be the biggest game of 2018. That is not coming to the Switch, but yeah, there's actually a petition going on to try to get it to the Switch, but I don't know if it's going to happen or not. Yeah, I mean, like, I like things going to the Switch because then, you know, you can always play them on the road and keep them... I mean, like, if we end up going to some conventions and stuff, I'm sure I can take my Switch with me and put it in my backpack. Play yep. stuff. Well, you actually have your own carrying case now you got from LEGO. Mm-hmm. They sent you a really cool one. Yeah, I've got to do the LEGO Worlds thing on that. Have fun with that! It's never-ending. Yep. As far as I know. Well, and they keep adding stuff to it all the time. It looks like there's a treasure chest up here. I do like there. building stuff, but... I want it! Only thing about LEGO Worlds is ah. like... Oh, yeah. No, you have to keep finding different... Like, you can't build whatever you want. You have to find the materials to build. Yep. So, we decided to play this game for you guys and gals before we went to uh, New York Comic Con. I'm hoping that Yay. we can get at least, like, uh, two episodes out of this. Uh, I heard that after you beat a, a boss, usually the demo ends, but... I want to s squeeze as much content from this game as possible because we're not quite ready to release uh, Metroid or Beetlejuice yet. Yeah. Um, I thought I would have that ready before Comic-Con, but we only have one day before we leave, so it's kind of like... Uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, I had my panelists and before we left and stuff. Yeah. 
And also, uh, I have to relearn how to play Gundam, so... I know you guys have an episode of Gundam coming out soon, but we have to rethink how to play the game, because... Yeah, we got later to a, We got wrecked. We got to a point where, like, Luke and me, the controller, and... I was, I was like, Psh, I'll be able to do this easy, but then I couldn't, so... Ha! Yeah, there are some moves that we have to figure out, some strategies that we have to figure out how to do. Well, I mean, Gundam, it does make sense. So, it we found uh, an accessory. Wait, how do I get to it? What? What? Stop that game. I'm hitting buttons. There it is. Okay, so we found something called a Jewel of Protection. So that is our first Ooh. accessory. I know, it's kind of fancy. I just love the Super Nintendo vibe of this game, though. It has classic sprites, but it also has a lot of the subtle touches that you love from the Bravely series. Yeah. Like, the backgrounds are just phenomenal. Well, I love the the cave right here, how it's glistening and stuff. That looks really awesome. It's beautiful, actually. Ah, too many battles! I wish... Oh, a oh, no, snake! Oh, a snake! In the, not in the grass, Ow. but in the cave. I'll show you how snake-like I can be, snake! <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it didn't really work. So, uh, my key strategy so far is basically defend like crazy, build up my boost meter, and then go all out once I have, like, four boost abilities. Oh, okay. I know it's not the most exciting thing to watch, but it seems to be working pretty well. Like, oh. in terms of uh, delivering a lot of damage on the bad guys. Yeah. All right, I mean, here we go. I mean, you always have to upgrade stuff when you're in an RPG or whatever. And level slash. Here we go. Boom. No stun though. That's not good. Ow. Luckily we have ow some grapes. So, oh. Ooh. Oh, that's not good. I used all my abilities. Aha. Aha. Oops. <laughs> now what? We're in a bit of a pickle. We are. Um. We're gonna have to use defense, and then, uh... Well, actually, what items do I have? Um, I have healing grapes. You have grapes that hopefully... yeah. Alright, so that will bring back my... Inspiring Plum brings back your SP gauge. But we need healing um, grapes at the moment, so... Yep. Aha, you fiends! Alright, I need a plum! For inspiration. Mmm, delish! Oh, Foul being! Actually, that would only work if it was a bird. Yeah. Foul beast. Alright, let's see how you like this. Alright, one's gone. Just a snake left. Yeah, can you imagine being Ow. up against a snake that's taller than you? I would run, screaming like a little girl in the opposite direction. Saying, GIANT SNAKE! That would be kind of like a giant snake, though. Yeah, it would. So Flurry is a great ability for attacking enemies just with just one, one attack, them. but the level slash really evens up the playing field, which is awesome. Yeah, I like being able to attack multiple at once. Well, oh, hello! Yes. Shall we record your progress? Yes, please do that. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, kind sir. It's Robin Hood. I don't know what it looks like. I'm a little... It kind of does. He has a feather in his cap. Aha! We found the boy! Oh. Hello, boy. Do tell them about this friend of yours. Uh, how he knows how to fight. He sure does! Oh. He's stronger than all of you put together. Well. <laughs> that's a great laugh. Stronger than all of us. <laughs> hey, come on. Hey, come on. Don't laugh at my small stature. <laughs> <laughs> Hear out. that, mate? This Edge Knight's the strongest blade in the realm. <laughs> If he thinks he can best all of us, he's more than a madman the knight. Well, this ain't a fairy tale, boy. Real knights don't piddle away their days in the company of swine herds. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. If he's a knight from the stories, a damsel in distress might serve as better fight. <laughs> wow, you're replaying the same laugh track, guys. Way to go. <laughs> yeah. Come on, stop it. I'm a small little boy. Don't make him fun of my height. Oh, be laughing when Sir Berg gets here! Sir Berg? Now there's a frightening name. Look, me arms all Stop. the trembling. <laughs> Shut up, all of you. <laughs> Boss? Right. Reckon the boys got more courage than a lot of you, and more wits to boot. So I'm a yammering and start sharpening your stabbers. <laughs> Boss? 
Yeah, well, guess what? Things are gonna happen to you! That's right. Aye, it ain't like he's your own son or nothing. Why should he care? No, no, not. Says Philip. Why, indeed. Things could have gotten interesting, though, if he does show. Always had a soft spot for men with more courage than sense. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, I just felt like saying, uh. <laughs> Yeah. What do you say, laddie? Care to join our little family? We're always looking for men with pluck. Not on your life. Well, that's just not nice. I'll never join you. I'm going to be like so bad. This is not a Star Wars thing, boy. I'll never join you. Yeah. You think the only one who feels that way, boy? Let me tell you something. Da da da. Mm -hmm. What is it, boss? <gasps> Sir. Sorry, I'm late. Got held up along the way. Yay, voice acting. Hi, look. It's the mighty Sir Berg in the. What's in? Looks like the kid could have left the whole time. He's right by the exit. How get in here anyway? We're at the lookouts. Leading it's in the so dirt, last I saw. <laughs> Sir! Stay back! Did, did, did he just... He parried the boss's blow! Hey, me, I've never seen no one do that before. You're quick, all right. And strong. Clearly, no common hedge knight, are you? Just as you are no common brigand. Like it, do you? It just so happens to be a present. An old friend. Earhart? Oh, you know the man, do you now? So it is his blade. As if I needed another reason to cut you down where you stand. How do you know Earhart's rogue? Speak, <laughs> or I'll slice your throat. So intense. Is that it? I can see it in your eyes. They blaze like fire when you said his name. Look, I don't know the past between you and Earhart. But if you're looking to ask questions of me, my good sir, you'll have to earn the right! Very Whoa. intense. Oh my gosh! Whoa! Oh my gosh, she's ginormous! How about the fiend? I'm gonna have to earn the right, Sir Ulbrich. I am not worried about the likes of- Oh, okay, maybe a little worried. I was just thinking when they said Sir Berg, Oh, I'm trembling! <laughs> like, wouldn't it be funny if his name was, like, something that was, like, not intimidating at all, like, Sir Happy or something? <laughs> like... <laughs> yeah. I don't know. No, it's Sir Berg, though. He, I think that he renamed himself Sir ah. Berg. Ah, stop! Oh man, I don't know how you're gonna take these guys down. We're gonna do our best. Ulbrick, you have to save Philip! I'm kinda sad to see this end though, because this is a lot of fun. I know. I'm playing a couple fun games right now Gundam and this. So, Gundam, I feel like a bit salty, because I have to learn how to play it. Do you need me to go get a salt shaker from the kitchen for you? Or? No, that's fine. Well, I mean, if we weren't trying to complete all the trials, it wouldn't be that big of a deal. But yeah. How about this? How about what? Ow! Oh, stop with the small stabbards, jerks. No. Uh oh. That move is gonna be problematic. That guy looked way smaller on the map. I'm just gonna... Let's defend this ability. Defend. Ow. Man, Old Brick is so cool. Whoa! How many healing grapes do we have left? We might be in a bit of a sticky. How about this? We need to get rid of some of that guy's men. Yep. Time to slay me some men. With level slash. Whoa! Nice. Oh my god! It's just you awesome. and me, Viking. Ow. Yep. I know, basically. The giant viking. He does look like it. Alright. Let's, uh, increase my power, then. If that's all you're gonna do, is just increase your skill. Ow. That was unnecessary. 
All right, my turn. And flurry, fool! Eat this! 872, that just makes me feel all kinds of sad. Uh-oh. Defend, defend, defend! You must I defend! Okay. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, your HP! We're in big trouble. But we still oh have some healing grapes left, so we're okay. It's the right, Amber. Ow, you mean person. Ulbrich, you can do it! This guy is nothing compared to you. How about this? You can do it. Well, I mean, he is huge, Amber. Yeah, he's pretty big. Make sure he doesn't step on you. We will fight to the last man! Fool! Oh, that, I thought that was gonna work. Ah! This is not good. I think you did hurt his feelings by calling him a fool, but other than that, it really did. No, all we just said, I think that. Uh oh. Uh, defend, 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 so defend, 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 defend! Oh my gosh. Let's try two times, three times to defense. All right, that reduced it considerably. Okay, we got a nice. game plan. All right, so let's try this on for size. No, that the spear is gonna be not a good idea. We'll, we'll keep doing flurries. Aha! 866. Ah! Not the good. Come on, Sir Holbrick, you can do it. We don't have enough healing grapes. This oh is, if this is gonna gosh. come down to just, oh, jeez. I don't want to grind. I mean, I'd love to get three episodes out of this, but I really don't want to. I can beat him, I know I can. What about? Ow. We have to go to the store and get more grape juice. Well, I don't want to buy from that one vendor because my grapes taste like anchovies. That's odd. Uh, oh. How about we will defend! I think not. Yeah, this is a stalemate. Oh my no. gosh. Could have been a lot worse, but... Here we go! Eat Flurry! This has got to be it. You've got to be kidding me! Oh man! How strong is this guy? Stronger than people go biking! Oh great. Oh, sorry. We have to use a- we're gonna leave ourselves open and- what is that? Deals fire damage to all foes. That sounds fun. Okay. But he's been hiding in a cave, I don't think that's gonna bother him all that much. Jeez. Alright. Gonna have to risk it and go for the plum, because we have no way to attacking at all. Well, I mean, I can attack with my sword, or I can defend. Yeah, I got nothing. Oh my gosh. We're in trouble. <laughs> All we can do is tiny little blows with our sword. Oh, snap. Uh-oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Defend times one. Whoops. Ooh. Uh-oh. Ulbrick. Well, uh... No. One last jaunt. More knightliness. Oh, Philip. Ugh. Yes, you failed, good sir knight! No! no! Oh, well, at least it's gonna be three episodes. That's something, right? I feel sad. Well, anyway, guys and gals, that does it for this demo of uh, this game. Octopath Traveler. Octopath Traveler. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and join us tomorrow for the finale, probably, of this awesome demo on the Nintendo Yay. Switch. God bless and happy gaming. See ya.